I'm just calling this short Moxie's dad, and honestly, he's lucky I even decided on that since there are so much more fitting titles I could have used instead. I do want to talk about some things. First, being that Crimson is a mob boss, right? I'm not saying you have to be incredibly smart to be one, I'm just saying at the very least, you can't be gullible, right? And judging by the size of Crimson's home, it seems he's rather good at what he does. So how does someone like Crimson fall for Chaz basically saying, hey, I'm rich, and just believe it? No checking to confirm the money, nothing. Just straight up believes the very dude who abandoned his son during a heist. I know Crimson doesn't give two you-know-whats about his own flesh and blood, but I'm so surprised he didn't annihilate Chaz the minute he found out Chaz was the reason his son was jailed. Not out of love for his son, but at the very least out of pride? Hypothetically speaking, if Chaz did strike it big and have tons of money, I 100% believe Crimson would have married his son off to this dude and then still got rid of Chaz to make Moxie a widower. That's one less dude to deal with. But who's next? 